Okay, so good morning. It is Friday the, I have absolutely no idea. I don't know where my watch is. Slight disaster. As you can hear, it's absolutely hammering down. It hammered down, well, it's been raining on and off since we got here yesterday afternoon. And then all night it's been raining and it rained really heavy in the night. And we woke up this morning to see drips coming out of possibly there. The whole of my seat is uh, wet. The floor was wet. Luckily we got these, um, I don't know what you call these part, these little mat things, Traeger mills. Um, and you can just like cut them to size, which is lucky because we could just take out that piece. So all my stuff's over, well, stuff is, that was there is there. Um, it's, it's wet. It could have been worse. Could have had the laptop out overnight there. Could have had anything there. So luckily, nothing electrical was wet. But he went up, got the ladder and went up. He's taken the thingy out. He went open the skylight when it wasn't raining just now. And there was a massive pool there. So it must have suddenly hammered down. And there must be a little tiny pinprick of a hole somewhere. Can't do anything about it now. Um, but yeah, absolutely happy days but like I say it could have been worse so I had a bit of a mop up this morning could have been up on up by the bed is but then I suppose that would have woken us up but I don't know just annoying good morning it is Saturday the 7th of August 2021 we're just leaving Burrs Country Park the cobbles over the cobbles that's why oh it's so noisy and bouncy um Burrs country park um caravan and motorhome site which is in Bury near manchester it was a really really nice site actually um we parked sort of like nearly facing the steam railway line we were going to go on it but yesterday we got caught in so many traffic jams it's unbelievable we didn't really have time and then we're dealing with a blinking stupid leak behind us which is still not fixed obviously because oh it's still been raining so you can't really fix a leaky thing outside when it's raining can you <sighs> so um we are on the way to get two more andy Scott. Scott sculptures. Where are they? Utoxeter. Utoxeter. Where's Utoxeter? Staffordshire. Staffordshire. Oh, look at the little pony things. Shetland ponies. Um, yes. Yeah, sorry. Um, blah, blah. yeah, that's where we're going. And then our last campsite is tonight at Tewkesbury Abbey. Abbey. Not actually in the Abbey. Um, Canada geese in the field. Right, see you later. So we've travelled down um, and we have actually landed at U Utoxeter or Utoxeter. I've always thought of it as Utoxeter, but um, and there's two Andy Scots here. We've just found them driven, driven past oh, on the road and they're both on roundabouts. So the one that uh whoo, the one we're walking to is Centaur. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Centaur. Half man, half horse. Half man, half half horse. Oh. So let's turn right, you around. There it is. Not going to be able to get anywhere near it really because can't really clamber over the flowers. He's got little wings on his hoofs. <sighs> is it looking down? No I can't really there. see. Oh, I see. Yeah. Shame I can't take you in closer, but Leon, my assistant, is taking some photos.
Okay, so we've left that one behind. We are now walking away from that one um, down to, actually it's not the next roundabout, it's the little one after it, isn't it? Away. Yeah? Uh, I, I think it was. Yes, it is. So, so one was near Aldi and one was near Lidl. One, <laughs> Aldi, Aldi and Lidl, there you go. Um, yeah, so when we get there, I'll show you. And there it is on that roundabout, another one we can't get to. Anyway, uh, but you can't guess what it's called. It's called the Bowl. Oh, Piggy's camping. Oh, little Piggy Piglets, look. Oh, let's go and say hello. Hello, little Piggies. Oh, I like that one over there. Come on, come back. Oh, they're coming back. Hello. Oh, aren't you lovely? Hello. What's your names? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. My mum is going Oh, where's mum? Up the hill. Oh, yeah, there's mum. Oh, my. Followed by another little one there. Oh. Aren't they lovely? Hello, piggies. Hello. I'm just saying hello to your children. Who's this little one here? Hello. The tiny one. Well, no, that's not really. Different colour to all the rest, though, isn't he? Hello. Ah, oh, well, we're going to have to go now. Okay. It does. There's little cows oh, there's little there's cows and a couple of sheep over there. Yeah. Well, bye then. There we go. Shame I can't get any closer. Never mind. I'm sure. I'm sure. Where's he gone? I'm sure, my beautiful assistant, who's changing the battery on his camera, um, will take some nice photos. So there you go. So that's my good job, my my good deed for the day. We're still stuck in the traffic jam. We've moved about two centimeters. Um, so the traffic officers moved that car into our lane, but obviously you're still going to get done for it, hopefully, so that they could actually get past to get to the incident. They moved the broken down car out of the way, um, and my good deed for the day was offering them a whole packet of penguins. The people in the broken down car, because they had two little kids with them, so uh, they took those. So that's good. I feel all, na all nice and glowy inside. Good morning. It is Sunday. The eh? The eighth. It might be the eighth of August, 2021. It's seven o'clock in the morning. So last night we stayed at Tewkesbury Abbey um, club site got there very late because of the blinking traffic jams which turned out to be well well I don't think it was an accident that was causing ours but there was um they were replacing a bridge where was the bridge being replaced uh, near Warsaw near Warsaw um so that whole section of road on the M6, M6 was out so we got to where they were replacing the bridge with this massive great big crane got through that obviously we started going faster like normal on the other side going north it was exactly the same as what we'd just been through so and the behavior of some people was absolutely disgusting um so yeah we arrived quite late so we are now just going for a little walk around Tewkesbury. It's probably going to rain, 
but there you go. And then we're going home. See you later. Here's the Abbey. It has just struck seven o'clock. The Abbey is there and oh, the campsite is just the other side of that car park. So we are quite close. Did it chime all night or not? Yeah, it must have, but didn't really notice it, but then I've got earplugs in. So left there hand is middle. left hand middle. Oh, a bit poking out. Well, I can see a bird up there. On the right hand one at the top, right hand actually at the top. So we could hear peregrines when we got here yesterday. And there's is that one fly is that a one that's flying? That's a, there's one there, look, just flying. There you go. Whee! Um yeah, we could hear them. And they have actually got them nesting and there's the nesty leggy boxy no, not a block. Where's he got? I'm talking to myself. It's not a nest box, is it? It's just like a ledge platform sticking out yeah which is up sort of like oh um the three little things going together there's like a little ledge there like this bit on the ground part of the abbey then yeah when they um disillusioned disillusioned the abbey in 15 whatever um they kept the centre bit as the town church oh. so there's a peregrine up there and there's a pigeon oh there's two pigeons there yeah. now just thinking uh oh which way are we going either way go let's go way. this way so, it's a mulberry tree. It's a mulberry tree? What, as in here we go round there? Yeah. Oh. Stuff, the berries being trodden into the church carpets. Really? Yeah. Oh, can you eat mulberries then? There's lots of pigeons. Under this old tree. Some quite old gravy things and whatever you call those. It's not a grave, is it? Well, it is a grave. I've forgotten the word. A tomb? tomb yeah. There's lots of them. Ooh, some sort of uh, angely thing with their wings spread. Is it? Pretty flowers. Ah, beautiful. There's the other end. Quite impressive there. I nearly missed these. It's all like um, very old gravestones and stuff, all weathered and worn. Can't read anything. On, oh, I'm not going to do that one. Don't know. Can't read. Can't really see something. Eighteen. I can see the. I can see the year, eighteen fifty. But those look a bit older than there. What's this? Don't know. Is it from the door? Okay, let's go this way. Right, more gravestoney things here. Bits of stuff that's fallen off as well. And ugh. so you reckon that's old? Then they've just. Yeah. Because it looks new to me. Probably washed it. Yeah, oh, yeah, I suppose it could have. Yeah, possibly. Oh, look at the carving on that roof ceiling. 
not roof, ceiling. Whoa. I don't know if that's going to come out. Knock it all that. And then there's that. Whoa. Yeah, I'd say it's recently been jet washed because look at the dustiness on the door look. Hey? Pixie haven't done yet. Oh yeah. Up there. I don't know if I prefer it the I'm jet washed. <laughs> <laughs> so it just looks a bit too new. Okay. I like it dirty. <laughs> there we go. That is Tewkesbury Abbey. I don't know if there's any more of it. Next to a field. I think our campsite is over there somewhere. Just make out the stained glass windows, but obviously. We're on the wrong side. <laughs> Okay, so we crossed over this bridge, oh, little path here, um, over this bridge at this mill thing. Oh, little birdies or something in there. Um, so this is the River Avon, there's the Abbey, and we're going to go for a little wander in a minute through the oldie worldy streets of Tewkesbury. Abbey Mill Sluice. Abbey Mill Sluice? Oh. So you just make out some narrow boats there. And some swans. And some really old houses. So I don't know what the thing is. I don't know why there's lots of different flags hanging from the houses no. that we just walked past. I don't know. What's all that about? Okay, a quick correction. This is not the River Avon, this is the River Severn. Or part of the River Severn. Well, no, it's not the whole of the River Severn no. here, is it? No. It's part it's of the, the river. The other half is over there. It just confused us. Didn't so, where is the it's, Avon Mill? It's not anything to do with the a River Avon then? No. Right, okay. It is the River Severn. tea rooms in Dukesbury and it was it dates from around 1470 and it was once owned by Lucille Moore wife of John Moore from the John Moore Museum across the road I have no idea who John Moore was don't judge that's old isn't it yeah all these flags what's all these flags different flags about all the way along. That's old. That's Georgian there, isn't it? That's not Georgian. I take it people still live in these. Look at the beans. Quite old. Look at the carvings. So if you can see the carvings, like by the top. No, not the top windows. The middle windows along the top and each side. You can 
that's an old one there. It's got like a hat thing on the front, so whether it was a used to be an old hat shop or something. Just know the tourist information. Place. Oldy sort of building there. Although it has got oh, I don't know. Is this the same street or a different? No, this is the other street. Oh, okay. okay, so we started our journey from leaving home in Plymouth. We travelled up to Malvern Hills and then we met Smithy and then we stayed at, I can't remember. And then, so that's here. Oh, here we go. Englethwaite Hall. Um, so then we went up to Strathclyde Country Park and then ooh, North Lee Day Caravan Park and then we went across up to there, Grand, Grand Ten on Spey Caravan Park. Uh, up there it started to rain really badly. Huntley Castle uh, down to Silver Bank something or other. Stonehaven Queen Elizabeth Park. Bulburnie Park Caravan and Motorhome Club site. And that is, I think, Edinburgh Club site in there. Back up to here. I can't actually remember there. And <laughs> then we were there. I don't know. And our last stop is here at Tewkesbury Abbey. Um, that one, wherever that was last night, it was quite a nice site actually. So there we are.